South Pacific Brewery Managing Director Stan Joyce says the company was not informed of the ban. We feel that as a taxpayer, as a part of the community, we should be consulted in that process. NCD Governor Paul Sparkop on Tuesday said the recent confrontation between the police and the PNG Defence Force in Port Mosby was alcohol related. This has forced a ban on liquor sales and consumption in the city. It's an incident that happened out of a, a uh, um, situation that emerged in a bar. Uh, it's uh, rising out of drunkenness or alcohol abuse. The NCD Liquor Licensing Board, in a bid to address the recent incident, suspended all liquor trading licenses for small bottle shops yesterday. Stan Joyce says a common sense approach should have been taken to make all stakeholders in the industry more aware of the liquor restrictions. What's really required is a common sense approach to solving some issues. And by a common sense approach, I mean sitting down and having some dialogue with all the stakeholders um, in the industry and the consumers. The ban on liquor in Port Mosby will go for an indefinite period of time, while in Central Province, a two-week ban was imposed yesterday by the provincial administration. Stanley Ovet Jr., National MTV News.